first time I ever came to school, my seventh grade year, I walked into the main hallway and I was just, just gasping, looking up, everything was big, everything was so like state of the art. It didn't really look like a school. It looked like more like a college than an actual middle school. Lady Bird Johnson Middle School uh, opened in August of 2011. Uh, it is the first net zero school in the state of Texas. When we talk about net zero schools, what that basically means is uh, the school produces as much energy as what it consumes over the course of a one year period. The way we do that is through the use of sustainable energies. This school is equipped with a uh, 600 watt uh, solar array and also has 12 wind turbines that provide power to the building. One of the more unique and innovative features of this building is that we consider it truly a living science laboratory. There are four learning nodes in the main hallway. They're totally interactive devices where, where the students can go up and learn about solar energy, wind energy, water conservation, and recycling. When you first walk in the building, it's a massive hallway with all the geothermal nodes. It's like a museum, kind of, like the science museum. I'm kind of like a nerd. So that stuff just intrigues me. <laughs> Other than it's a green school, which there aren't very many of those, especially in Texas, um, it was designed to be different from the inside out. The pedagogy and how people teach is different. The hiring is different. Want to blow up education and make it better for kids. Skinny. I might be skinny. We're not a one-room schoolhouse anymore. And so we wanted to make sure we had a lot of technology implementation. Kids were collaborating, kids were using a lot more 21st century type skills than sitting in rows and listening to direct teach. If we ask our teacher a question, she might not give us an answer, she just said, go look it up. It's not a go, go over to the shelf, go get your textbook, go find it. It's just go look it up on Google. It's easier to learn. It's not like institutionalized. It's more free, more natural. Solar power. What did you see outside? The pedagogy of teaching is constantly changing, and so we want to make sure that our classrooms are really designed for kids and not for adults. I would say that the core belief in this building is about empowering kids. We want them to be passionate. You could say that the building has connected passion to them. Nice. <laughs>